The following video is a recap of Charmander Community Day 2020. And welcome to Lewis's Adventures Place Pokemon Go with me, Lewis Magnucci, as your host. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And be sure to subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. In this video, we are going to cover 2020 Charmander Community Day, which came in second place last month after a day of voting on Twitter. Okay, the first task we have to do is power up a Pokemon 10 times, catch 15 Charmander, and make five nice throws. My community day experience got off to a slow start today. As you see here, I'm on the road to completing the first step of this breakthrough research. Which of course, I had to um, catch five Charmander, make five nice throws, and power up a Pokemon ten times. And of course, it wasn't easy, but in the end, I got the job done. And I always enjoy doing Community Day. It's just that this year has been strange and weird for me doing it. But hopefully in the future I will go back out and do it the way I used to prior to what is going on in the world currently.
We have finally completed the first part of this special research. Now the second step involves us transferring 10 Pokemon, catching 15 Charmander, and evolving 3 Charmander. For the second task, it required me to catch 15 Charmander, transfer 10 Pokemon, and evolve 3 Pokemon. And of course, at this point I had already gotten 2 Shinies. Of course, one of them you will see me catching momentarily in this clip. Enjoy the music that I've set this montage.
Okay, we finally completed the second step, and now we're on to the third step. Make three great curveball throws, evolve one Charmeleon, and transfer ten Pokemon. This quest was quick, simple, and easy to do. All I had to do was make three great throws, transfer ten Pokemon, and evolve a Charmeleon into a Charizard. And as you see here, this is another one of the shiny Charmander I caught during this community day. And of course, more to come. Okay, we finally completed the third step, and now we're on to the fourth one, which involves us making nice throws 15 times, taking a snapshot of any Fire-type Pokemon, and last but not least, powering up a Pokemon 10 times. It turns out, instead of taking a picture of a Fire-type Pokemon, you have to make 15 nice throws, Catch 15 Charmander and power up a Pokemon 15 times. I do apologize. This was based on information that I found online which later turned out to be incorrect. But for the rest of this video, after I complete this, all you do for the fifth and final task is just collect your rewards and you're done. We have finally done it. We finally completed this research and I will leave you to the rest of my hunt for Shiny Charmander in Pokemon Go. Well, I close out this Charmander Community Day 2020 with saying my final count is 21. 21 shiny Charmander. Unlike in 2018 where I had a mediocre catch 
that year, in May of 2018. This Charmander Community Day makes up for the one that was disappointing to me back in 2018. And this is Lewis saying, Thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. And remember, it's time for adventure. Also, during these times, when going out, always wear a mask, practice social distancing, always wash your hands, or carry hand sanitizer.